I was kind of on the event high and was going for the gold and suffered the consequences. contests are all about is about coming in the mountain hanging with your bros and getting some which you feel confident in doing is gonna make what kind of run you're gonna have what kind of results you're gonna have in any kind of competition didn't get as much money as I would like to so I want to come back tomorrow pissed so you better look out I'm out for money I tried to move and there was a numb feeling like it felt like it was dislocated or whatever, but I knew that there was something significantly wrong that um, I wasn't going to be able to get back. <laughs> oh, get up, get up, get up! T, come on bro, get up! T, get up, man! Just get whatever you can, anytime you can. Race the wrong core. Here we go. One hospital, and they said that I could possibly lose my leg. So um, the solution that they had for me at Denver General was was pretty good. I mean, they wanted me to be back competing, doing what I love to do. And yeah, I still have a plate in my leg, and I'm still going out, and I'm I'm solid at what I do, and I feel strong. So I think everything that they did for me was a success for sure. The doctor was really supportive of what I do, and and uh, he related to everything that, you know, my lifestyle and everything that I do and wanted to accommodate me in the best way that he could. I think it, it probably took me a good three months. My leg hurts, like, nonstop. I mean, my leg's probably going to hurt for the rest of my life and I'm going to have pain. But, you know, the strength that's there and what it comes down to is what's mentally in your head. Welcome back to Crested Butte, Colorado for the 8th Annual Magna Block U.S. Extreme Border Fest presented by Subaru. Next up on Extreme Day is Teague Mullen, an amazing story. In an all-out effort to win two years ago, seriously injured himself. Here he is, back competing. Yeah, I still have a plate in my leg and I'm still going out and I'm, I'm solid at what I do and I feel strong. Here he is, poised to at least make the podium, coming into the day in fourth place with a strong run here. He could be on the podium, maybe even take the championship. Teague's riding well, and you can see his legs actually working to absorb the terrain as he moves over this hard snow. Like a lot of riders, Teague has roots in the valley. He actually went to elementary school in Crested Butte. Right now living in Sandpoint, Idaho, where he's a terrain park manager. And you can see that he does not have fear, and he does not hold back despite the injury. He's one of the more well-rounded riders in the contest. He can do anything from border cross to big air. And as you can see, he's got no trouble at all on the steeps. And that really shows how steep it is here. A 45 to 50 degree pitch. He can reach back and touch the snow. Again, one mistake and it could be serious injury as we saw from that earlier story on Teague Mullen. But a great run right here. That should move him up. Teague Mullen from Sandpoint, Idaho. That was rad. Felt good all the way down. Got my first air more solid than the first time. A little bigger. I gotta work. Now our men's final. It's Ox Maloli, Nathan Park, Teague Mullen, and Chad Martin in the battle for the Wu-Tang. Little bit of mix up in the air when you see Chad Martin go down. And Teague Mullen takes the lead as they head into the speed section. See Teague hanging on to the hole shot. His arms are out to stabilize him. And that's allowing him to together, focus on riding Teague. a clean Hold line together. and milk the course for speed. A super run for Teague Mullen right now. This could be a huge confidence builder. He talked about finishing third in a wakeboard contest. 
He talked about finishing third in a border cross. But right now, poised to take the championship, except here comes Ox Maloli. On the inside, it's Ox Maloli. On the outside, it's Nathan Park, giving a big challenge to Teague Mullen. Let's see if Ox can hang on over the last jump. Oh, Ox blows up. Let's see what happens. Teague Mullen now in the lead, followed by Nathan Park and Chad Martin overtaking Maloli for third place. So it's Teague Mullen. This is going to be a huge victory. He is back. He is our champion. Teague Mullen wins border cross. That was the best run of the day. They tried to get ahead of me a little bit. I got the whole shot. They couldn't hold on and the air to flat. Held on, took on the money. The bottom line is that I'm back here competing and I'm going to do the best that I can do and we'll see where I end up.